Oh yeah, look, oh man, that is one of the clotter rings and it's gold. Alright, in today's video, we're going to be hunting a beach. I had to get to by boat. Let's give it a try, here we go. Alright, first target is a pop top. Hope that's not an indication of what's going on. Here we go. Okay, 18, 16, that's a good number. All I've found so far is... Just some pop tops, beer tops, and that's about it. That's kind of having my second doubt for that to taste. Oh my god! Oh, I think we got gold. Check it out. Oh yeah. Look, oh man, that is one of the clotter rings and it's gold. Unbelievable. That is awesome right there. Oh my god, that is awesome. Alright, here we go. I better start filming some. 44, 45. Pretty solid hit. Probably a dime. That's what I'm guessing, but I just don't know, dude. Let's see what we got here. Yeah, I think we got it. Oh, it's a bottle cap. Man, what else is in here? Nothing and a bottle cap. All right, here we All right, we got our very first coin. It's a penny, one gold ring, and one coin. It's pretty interesting that we're not getting a lot of coins. All right, we got a little shovel if we need it. Some kid lost that on the beach here. All right, here we go. All right, I think we might finally have a 47, 48, 50, I think I saw, 51. That's got to be either a quarter or a um, ring, one or the other. Let's see what we got down in here. All right, finally. Man, it's just not many targets at all on this beach. But if it's only one gold, I'll take it. Oh my god. Yep, got the first quarter here. Alright, here we go. Alright, we got our first sinker of the day right there. We need some more lead. Alright, just bag it up. Alright, what we got here? 48. You knew we got to quarter that one. No telling what that might be. Well, I say no telling. Most likely it's a quarter, but it's up in a high range that it could be silver or something anyway. We did just dig another quarter a minute ago, so we got 50 cents. All right, now we got 75. Maybe we'll break a dollar today. We'll see. All right, not many targets out here. We're digging a boatload of these are here, uh, pop tops and bottle caps, beer, beer caps. But not a whole lot else. We got about 79 cents, I think. Three quarters and four dimes, uh, four pennies. And that's about it. But uh, we're going to stay here probably another hour or so we do. And hopefully things will pick up. Here we go. All right, I thought we had another pop top. Man, I took so many of these 25s around here and all. It's actually a nickel. I can't believe it. Uh, we got about 84 cents, maybe. <laughs> we might break a dollar, maybe. We'll see. All right, we might be up to 94 cents. We're getting close now. Man, I might have to stay just long enough to break a dollar now. Oh, my God. So close. We get so far. Here we go. Check it out. We're pulling in multiple pop tops at a time. I just pulled three in. I just took one out of the Let's look at three of them. One scoop. Unbelievable. One little hole here. All right. They're everywhere. Here we go. We may have just broke a dollar. Another dime. All right. We're getting somewhere now. Here we go. All right. We may have a new, new little honey hole here. Starting to pick up several coins in here. I just got a target. Get ready to throw it back in the water. But I think that's some kind of badge or something. It looks like it definitely has some uh, design on it. Well, we're going to have to do electrolysis, and I think it might be steel. We'll definitely clean that up. Stay tuned. All right, I saw some hanging on my scoop. We got some dog tags right here. Maybe we can return those. Pretty cool. I'm not going to show them, but I'll try to find the owners of those. Pretty cool. Oh, I haven't found anything good lately. Got a 4851 here. I will record that one. Just knowing it's most likely going to be a quarter or silver. Let's see what we get here. You just never know. We got it. That was easy. I'm not seeing it yet. Oh, it's a ring. I see it down there. I was expecting a quarter. Look at that. That's going to be a silver ring for sure. I told you sometimes it's a ring and sometimes it's a quarter. We got a ring that time. Awesome. All right, here we go. All right, now I hate not to film off 52 and 48. Could be something good. This one seems awful deep, though. It's definitely not a very loud signal. I 
I'm going down deep on this first shovel full. Oh, here it is. That doesn't mean anything. It's a real light signal to start with. Alright, let's see what we got. I don't see anything in here. Oh, yep, it's a quarter. There it is. Alright, got another quarter. Alright, can you believe it? We got a car for the car light out here in the water deep. Pretty cool. We're definitely saving that. Here we go. I had a 44. I thought it was just going to be a penny, a dime, or something. I think we got another ring. Check it out. That is another silver ring for sure right there. That is so awesome right there. Three rings today. And we're not done. Here we go. I will call that a wrap. And it looks like we got a gold ring, two silver rings, and a very unusual looking piece. We got to do some lunch like trials on. So not a bad day. No guarantees yet. We'll check out when we get home. Stay tuned. We're heading home right now. Here we go. Not a bad day. Gold clotter ring. We got two silver rings. Uh, I got one other thing that's really cool. I can't wait to show you this. Let's check it out. All right, let's start off with, I want to show you all first, though, how many bottle tops I dug today. I don't know any way around digging these. Do you all, anybody know, put in the comments down below, but man that sounds so good right there i don't know how you could get around it tops same thing with the tops look at all the tops i dug unbelievable 175 over two getting close to three dollars in clad getting up there uh dog tags I, I hit them here so you can't see them but i'll try to find the owner of those one car to go to car collection we got two silver rings and they are they've been in there a while you can see how um, corroded they are. They're going to have to go through electrolysis and tumbling to get them clean again. But this gold always comes out pretty. Look at that. I don't know how long it's been there, but it looks beautiful. I am loving that ring right there. And talking about the clotter ring, I have found uh, multiple ones. I found this one. The wife wears it all the time. Uh, this one was definitely bigger than the, that one I just found. And another silver one here. So two gold or silver. I have found some stainless steel ones, some other ones and all that I've given away. But I, I love those clotter rings. They're pretty cool. But I got one more thing I got to show you. I got this and I almost threw it back because I was trash. It was all completely coated. And I started looking. It looked like I had a little bit of design. On it, so I kept it. I brought it home, put it in electrolysis and just for a few minutes. And then I tumbled it just for a few minutes. It's got a lot of clean to go. But you can see it. That is a knight's pin with like axes and suit of arms i think they call it but that is going to clean up really cool that is a cool find much more than i thought it was going to be right yeah that, that's going to come out really nice i can't wait to get that cleaned up all right well i hope you all enjoyed getting out with me today uh we did pretty good i, I wish we could do that every day all right appreciate everybody coming along don't forget to click like comment below share and what do you gotta do miss gigmaster what do you gotta do Grab the gig master. There you go. <laughs> we gotta wake Miss Gig Master up once in a while. Alright, we'll see you on the next adventure. Stay tuned.